there isn't any evidence that anybody gave me any favorable treatment. In 1978, Hillary took the family finances in hand. Through the Chicago Mercantile Exchange, she began gambling in risky cattle futures trades. In just 10 months, she made $100,000, having put up only $1,000. But now that her trade gambles have been made public, another of her former brokers in Little Rock is feeding suspicion about how she did it. These people truly don't like democracy. With recent news reports about the First Lady's earnings... I stopped trading in July of 1979. Many of us Americans are having a hard time with your credibility. Our commitment and our new covenant. Clinton's agenda for change has exposed deep ideological rifts. Now, the Clintons would say, we don't need to investigate, uh, uh, we don't need to let the American people know what was going on, we need to cover this up. That's the same thing Richard Nixon said in Watergate. Hillary had nothing to do with it.